is she is the general election candidate for Fine Gael in Dublin Rat Down. Uh, she's a family law expert with Madigan solicitors. It is Councillor Josepha Madigan. Where do you want to go if you're going to get elected? What are you going to do? I mean, when you're a woman, you're a Fine Gael mm. candidate in Dublin Rat Down. Other than the, the economics of, of uh, land, what else? There are a good few issues, George, that I'm quite passionate about. Self-employed is one. I've been self-employed for the last 20 years. Uh, I think that we need to equalise that in terms of the benefits that we receive. Uh, for example, I was I have two sons. I went back to work after eight weeks with both of them for simply because I am self-employed. I also want to look at childcare. I think that we need to address that. I think we need to look at maternity benefit and see if that is taxed, in my view, quite highly. I think we need to reduce that, help women back into the workforce Many, many issues. I mean, I am obviously a Fianna Gael councillor and I want to try and keep this recovery going as we have. I think there's been a huge amount of work done since since we took over in 2011 and I want I am determined to try and continue that. You are a councillor um, and, and of course we're talking in the wake of, of uh, what appeared to be uh, low standards in high places. Uh, what was your reaction to that? I was looking at it last night George, as if I was in a parallel universe, to be perfectly honest. I mean, as you say, I am a councillor myself and I found it really it, difficult This was the prime time investigation. This was the program, prime time, yeah. yeah, the SIPO investigation. And in fact, you, you mentioned to me off air about my late father and I do remember he gave evidence in a tribunal. Now, obviously, he wasn't, uh, he wasn't accused of anything himself. I think it was for some developer uh, and he was giving evidence as a witness. But I remember he said that going down the annals of the corridor of the council offices was like Paul O'Connell avoiding a scrum away from developers, you know. But it's very important to stress one thing, George, and this is a point that is forgotten. Obviously, it goes without saying it's absolutely abhorrent the way that these people, councillors, behaved, right? But at the end of the day, as a councillor, you're entitled to bring motions for developers as long as it's done in public and in transparency and it's fully transparent. Like I have acted for developers in the council for a retirement village, for example, in Ticknock and various other um, applications. So just because you're doing work on behalf of a developer, it does not mean per se that it's in any way illegal or in any way unethical. I found it very interesting that none of the councillors, as far as I've heard today anyway, have actually resigned. I think they've resigned from their parties, but I don't actually think they've resigned no, they from the council. Resigned, and I yeah. think that's a disgrace. I think they absolutely have to resign. I, I, I can't see how they... they well, people they don't resign now as public life. Yeah, but that's wrong. I'm sorry, I think that's very wrong. <laughs> you know, if, I mean, there's, I'm a lawyer. You know, in any profession, and I know I suppose you could call is politics a profession, you know, there's a question mark over that, but in a sense it is, and the high ethics and integrity that you bring to public life, you have as lawyers. There are lawyers, I remember Michael Lynn and Thomas Byrne and all of these uh, lawyers that took clients' funds. It was the same thing. You're kind of going... Are we living on it? Where, where, what are these people doing? What are they actually thinking? I mean, my integrity is so important to me in politics and as a lawyer. And I found it really, really disappointing to see that there are still councillors doing this. You know, I mean, it was like looking at a movie to be honest. All right, my guest is Councillor Josepha Madigan, a general election candidate for Fine Gael in Dublin Rathdown and, of course, family law expert uh, with Madigan solicitors.